Hello everyone, I'm Craig Shields and welcome to the Two Green Energy Report, where each week we take on the tough realities of renewable energy and electric transportation. I'm pleased to have on the show this week Michael Scully, the CEO of M-Cycle. Michael, welcome, man. Thanks very much, Craig. Glad to be here. You know, you probably have seen our recent episodes where we've, for whatever reason, we've had a whole raft of shows having to do with electric transportation. I think they've been pretty good. Uh, but what we've tried to do, this is we've tried to cover the gamut of stuff here. And most of the recent speakers, I think, have been on the theoretical side of things. We've had um, advocates for electric transportation, we've had battery chemists, and you know, I write a lot on the adoption curve for electric vehicles, in mm -hmm. other words, what I think I see coming. Um, you, on the other hand, are, though you are a thinker and a planner and a designer, you're a doer. You're actually in the arena. I'm reminded of the Teddy Roosevelt quote about the, it's not the critic who counts, it's the man in the arena. You're in the arena. Well, I tried to be, yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, terrific. Right. Tell, why don't we jump right into what it is you're doing. You have a product, and why don't you show the audience at home a little bit about that? Okay. Yeah. Well, I'm sure on the screen they'll see the picture of the M-Cycle. And this is a vehicle that I was thinking about when I was working on an electric car, and I realized that we don't have the money, or at least the people I was working with didn't have the money to do an electric car, which cost millions. So I thought, what could you do and what would I like to drive? Because I like cars and I'm a couch potato, so what would I like to drive? This is what I came up with, a fully enclosed pedal cycle with electrical assistance. Okay. They're using bicycles with electrical assistance right now and they're selling very well. But I don't like to be rained on. I don't like to be invisible to other drivers. So. This is what I came up with, fully enclosed, a decent seat, decent lighting, windshield wiper, uh, a little bit of a heater so you don't get too cold. It's uh, electrically, uh, uh, the, the electrical drive is an assistance mm -hmm. to the pedaling. Mm -hmm. So you have to pedal, so you get your exercise at the same time. Mm -hmm. And it's about the same size as a bicycle same width as a bicycle, so you can essentially use it like a bicycle. Let me ask you something. I notice in that diagram, the, there are three wheels, thus, yeah, but you call it a bicycle, so what's up with the three wheels? Uh, bicycle, just by virtue of bicycles, easy to say. Okay. It's really a tricycle, and the three wheels are so that it will self-balance when you stop. Okay. And then when you bank it over like a bicycle, the three wheels work oh, so that you al it allows you to bank it over like a tricycle. Now, the advantage of three wheels, particularly with two at the front, better braking and better cornering because you don't have one little wheel trying to hang on to the, uh, as you go around the corner. Right. I understand that's the way they design three-wheeled sports cars. Yes. Right. Yes. That's good. Uh, and then, of course, the banking gives you more security feeling as well. Okay. Now, um, I don't know whether you mentioned luggage, but I think you have, we have a slide here that speaks to that. Yes. Uh, if we look at this aerial view, you will see that uh, at the front of the vehicle, mm -hmm. there's quite a large open space, and that's probably enough for four to six uh, shopping bags. Mm -hmm. uh, other places don't have shopping bags. but And then behind the seat, which the seat will lock back in place, there's room for up to a uh, airline carry-on bag. Okay. So there's quite a bit of luggage space, and it's secure at least in the back because you can lock the uh, seat back, and of course the doors lock, mm -hmm. and then you've got security locks on it so that the because it's three wheels, it doesn't fall over like a bicycle, so it has to have a handbrake which locks in nice. place, and that locks as well, so anybody who tries to steal it, you've got this thing which is totally immobile, cannot be gotten into, and forget it. Why That's bother a to steal it? That's a terrific idea. <laughs> that is a great uh, feature of that. 